When people think about East Germany, they often think about things like the Stasi, the Berlin Wall and the dictatorship. They certainly don't give much thought to whether the East Germans celebrated Christmas. Well, the East Germans did celebrate Christmas and they celebrated it in much the same way that Germans have celebrated the season for hundreds of years and still do today. So that means they put their Christmas tree up on the 24th of December, they open their presents on the evening of the same day, and these presents have been supposedly brought by the Weihnachtsmann, who's a Father Christmas type character. The following day, the 25th, they would celebrate with friends and family over roast duck and roast goose with a side of red cabbage. Now Christmas in East Germany was certainly not a religious celebration. The regime frowned upon religion and that anyone who went to church was viewed with a great deal of suspicion. There was certainly no religious education at schools and as a result 80% of East Germans grew up as atheists. Now the East German regime tried to take the religion out of Christmas. So for example they promoted the singing of generic winter songs or pop songs over traditional Christian hymns and in the early 1950s they hoped to encourage people to celebrate Stalin's birthday on the 18th of December rather than Christmas a few days later. That said, and despite the fact that many East Germans were atheists, they still did go to church at Christmas. But they didn't go there to celebrate anything religious. They went there to listen to the traditional Christmas music. For example, Bach's Christmas Oratorio. So Christmas in East Germany was not a religious celebration. It was celebrated very much in the Germanic tradition of Yuletide, a celebration of light and love and a time to spend with friends and family.